What's going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be doing another career simulation video and today it will be on Miro Heiskanen of the Dallas Stars. As always we are going to be taking control of an Eastern Conference team and doing whatever we can to stay out of the way of the Dallas Stars and Miro Heiskanen in the simulation. Then we're going to simulate year by year to see his stats and if he wins any awards. So with all this being said, now let's see how Miro Heiskanen is looking heading into the first year of the simulation. So after giving us a glimpse of what he is capable of in his rookie season, EA has Miro Heiskanen already on the first defensive pairing of the Dallas Stars with John Klingberg. Heiskanen is an 84 overall, has medium elite potential, and his stats are 88 defensive and offensive awareness, 88 passing, and 88 puck control. Not bad at all, and let's see if it is enough to bring the Dallas Stars back to the playoffs once again. Year number one sees the Dallas Stars finishing fourth in the NHL and back into the playoffs for the second straight year, but they fall in the second round to San Jose. Miro Heiskanen's regular season sees him put up four goals and 19 assists for 23 points and was a minus 31. In the playoffs, he put up two assists. Not a great year for Heiskanen, but he does increase in overall and is now up to an 85. Year two once again has the Stars making the playoffs after they finished 12th in the NHL. The playoffs, though, were a short run as they fell in the first round to the Minnesota Wild. As for Miro Heiskanen, this season was an improvement as he scored 11 goals and 27 assists for 39 points on the year. He was injured for most of the playoffs and in the two games he appeared in did not put up any points. Miro Heiskanen is now up to an 87 overall and this was the last year of his current deal so in the offseason he does re-sign with the Stars on a 6 year deal worth $5.9 million per year. After a few short lived playoff runs, Year 3 has the Dallas Stars finishing 20th in the NHL and missing the playoffs for the first time since 2018. Despite the team not doing too well, Heiskanen still put up a decent season. In 80 games, Heiskanen scored 9 goals and 34 assists for 43 points and was a plus 12. Heiskanen did increase in overall again and is now up to an 88 overall. After missing the playoffs in Year 3, Year 4 has Dallas just barely sneaking into the playoffs after finishing 17th in the NHL. They fell in round 1 to the Coyotes in 6 games and once again cannot put together a deep playoff run. Miro Heiskanen put up another good season, scoring 5 goals and 48 assists for 53 points and was a plus 7. In the playoffs, he had a very solid showing, scoring 5 assists in 6 games. Heiskanen stays put at 88 overall. Year 5 is a weird one for Dallas as we see them finish 21st in the NHL but still somehow make the playoffs. Despite this, they upset the Blues and the Oilers and went on to the conference finals where they were eliminated by the LA Kings. Miro Heiskanen's regular season was a step back where he put up only 7 goals and 20 assists in 73 games. The playoffs were more of the same for him as he only scored 4 assists in 15 games and was a minus 8. Heiskanen decreases in overall and is now down to an 87. Finally, after a few years of just barely making the playoffs, Dallas finally gets into a comfortable playoff spot in year 6 as they finish 10th in the NHL. In the playoffs, they have a great run that sees them fall just one game short of the Stanley Cup Finals to the Edmonton Oilers. Miro Heiskanen again has another season with not much production as he finishes with just 7 goals and 31 assists for 38 points and was a plus 12. In the playoffs, he was solid putting up 10 assists in 17 games and with all this, Heiskanen stays put at 87 overall. Year 7 sees Dallas on the outside of the playoffs looking in as they finish 17th in the league. As for Miro Heiskanen, again he disappoints and has just a 28 point season where he scored 5 goals and 23 assists and was a minus 8. Heiskanen once again stays put at 87 overall. For the third time in the simulation, the Dallas Stars barely sneak into the playoffs as they finish 16th in the league, and in the playoffs fell in the second round to the St. Louis Blues. So far, this is one of the weirdest teams I've ever done one of these on. They constantly barely get into the playoffs, but once they get in, they usually pull off an upset or two. Anyway, Miro Heiskanen again struggles in point production, scoring only 8 goals and 20 assists for 28 points. He was a plus 12 this time, so that's an improvement, and in the playoffs he did contribute a bit offensively as he scored 2 goals and 3 assists for 5 points in 12 games. Heiskanen is still an 87 overall and signs a 3 year, $7 million per year extension with the Dallas Stars. Once again, the Stars fall out of the playoffs as they finished 18th in the league in year number 9. In 75 games this season, Miro Heiskanen scored 13 goals and 27 assists for 40 points and was a plus 7. With this season being a slight improvement over the last two ones, Heiskanen is back up to an 88 overall. Year 10 is Dallas back in the playoffs after they finished 15th in the NHL and in the playoffs they were swept by the Calgary Flames in round number 1. In the regular season, Miro Heiskanen had another average season where he scored just 6 goals and 29 assists for 35 points and was a plus 8. In the playoffs, he was solid and put up a goal and 3 assists for 4 points in 4 games. Heiskanen decreases once again and is back down to an 87 overall. So in his first 10 seasons, Heiskanen has played a total of 881 games, scored a total of 87 goals and 299 assists for 386 points. 
So far, Heiskanen has been really nothing more than average, and personally, I'm hoping after this next season, he signs elsewhere because Dallas just hasn't really done much so far. The inconsistent Dallas Stars once again find themselves out of the playoffs after finishing 22nd in the NHL. In a full 82-game regular season, Miro Heiskanen once again fell back in production and put up just 4 goals and 24 assists for 28 points and was a minus 4. Miro Heiskanen is still an 87 overall and decides to sign a 6-year extension with the Stars worth $10.5 million per year. Year 12 has the Stars missing the playoffs once again and falling even further down in the standings as they finish 27th in the NHL. After the really poor season by the Stars, to no surprise Miro Heiskanen also had a really poor season. In a full 82 game regular season, Heiskanen scored 8 goals and 14 assists for 22 points on the year. Heiskanen's overall drops again and he's now down to an 86. Again, the Stars have another brutal season where they finish 28th in the league and yeah, things just are not looking good for Heiskanen and Dallas. As for Heiskanen, the season only saw him score 4 goals and 29 assists for 33 points and was a minus 8. Despite all this, Heiskanen increases in overall again and is back to an 87. Year 14, Dallas still sucks and I'm praying that Heiskanen gets traded because literally nothing interesting has happened in this video so far. Anyway, as you can see Dallas finished 23rd in the NHL and Miro Heiskanen has another poor season. Heiskanen in 73 games scored 8 goals and 18 assists for 26 points and was a minus 23. Heiskin is still an 87 overall. For the fifth straight year, the Dallas Stars missed the playoffs and finished 21st in the league. Miro Heiskinen in 77 games scored 9 goals and 16 assists for 25 points and was a minus 17. Despite this, Heiskinen is still an 87 overall. In year 16, Dallas' playoff drought continues as they finished 19th in the NHL and missed the playoffs by just 3 points. Heiskanen season saw him score 7 goals and 17 assists for 24 points and was a minus 15. Heiskanen drops in overall again and is now back to an 86 overall for the second time. Year 17 is another year of Dallas missing the playoffs and another year of Heiskanen's career wasted. The Stars finished 23rd in the NHL and Heiskanen had another average season for his standards scoring 5 goals and 21 assists for 26 points and was a plus 2. After the season, Heiskanen has a major drop and is now down to an 82 overall and in the offseason finally decides he wants out of Dallas and decides to sign with the Florida Panthers on a two-year, $5.8 million per year deal. In their first year with Miro Heiskanen, the Florida Panthers finished 23rd in the NHL and for the 8th straight year, Miro Heiskanen does not see playoff hockey. In his first year as the Panther, Miro Heiskanen scored 5 goals and 20 assists for 25 points and was a minus 3. Heiskanen stays put at 82 overall. So in year 19, to no one's surprise, the Florida Panthers did not make the playoffs and finished second to last in the league. Heiskanen, the last year of his current deal, played in all but one regular season game and scored 8 goals and 11 assists for 19 points. He was a minus 36, and the 39-year-old is now down to a 75 overall and decides to finally retire. So in 20 NHL seasons, 19 simulated, Mira Heiskanen played in 1,681 games, scored 152 goals and 486 assists for 638 career points. And on top of it, one literally nothing. The simulation by far is easily the most boring one I've done, and I really thought this would be a fun one considering he does have an offensive side to him in real life, and he is a two-way player in the game, but sadly it just didn't work out in this simulation. Also before we go, I just want to give a shout out to the sponsor of this video, Fusion Hockey. Fusion Hockey is an online company that sells merchandise for all your favorite NHL teams as well as all your favorite NHL players. The designs are very unique and something any hockey player or fan will be interested in. As someone who used to play this position when playing hockey, my personal favorite stuff on the website is the goalie merchandise, and not only is it just hoodies and t-shirts, there are also phone cases as well. If you use the link in the description, you'll be given 5% off your purchase at Fusion Hockey, and honestly, I think you guys should really check them out. So once again, it is Fusion Hockey, link to the website will be in the description, and if you use the link, you'll be given 5% off your first purchase. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching this video, I'm sorry that not much really even happened in the simulation, that's just how EA had to play out, and yeah. Let me know who you guys want to see next. I'm thinking of doing the next one on a forward, so I'd love to hear what some of your guys' suggestions are for that. And yeah, once again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.